Hey, what's going on? This is Lo Vasquez with Lo Vasquez Photography, and today we're going to give you a quick tip on how to print from Lightroom. Um, it is my main source of printing, and I mean, I don't have a third party apps to actually uh, do printing or anything like that. This is the only thing I use for printing. I mean, I use Photoshop for editing, I use Lightroom for editing, but this is the only source that I use for printing. So, let me give you a quick example here. Um, I have this picture here. I want to go ahead and the customer wants to print it. 13 by 19 and luckily for me I have a 13 by 19 printer um, so you go over here to print right and you get a selection now the first thing you want to do is actually get your page set up you got a 13 by 19 so you have to put 13 by 19 uh, type paper on you have to tell it that it's a 13 by 19 uh, instead of actually going in here which you can 13 by 19 that's an a3 plus which uh, three 329 by 483 millimeters um, go in here like that you get a little more settings um right here i'm going to have a semi-gloss paper semi-gloss paper so i'm going to pick that it's going to be color now when it's 13 by 19 i like to keep it in speed i mean in quality uh speed i like to do smaller pictures because you can't really tell the detail difference um, when it comes to bigger uh prints yeah you can tell just a little bit and i like my prints to be very sharp um so I put it in quality now and I put sheets now it's not a 13 it's not a 5 by 7 so it's a 8 3 plus so that I'm gonna I want it borderless and it's a sheet of sheet of paper my ink is getting a little low you press OK and that picture is a landscape you can actually put portrait or landscape or I mean it doesn't really matter where you put it but at least you get a better view of the picture so you press OK now it's very simple all you have to do is just click on the picture you drag it, put it to the corner, get this little end, and you bring it out. And right now it's at a 13 by 19 uh, paper. If you press control and the mouse left and right, you can actually move it. The dimensions of a 13 by 19 is a little bit different than it's very, very close to the dimensions of your camera. So you don't have to really move it a lot. It only gives you like very little movement. So it's pretty close. So then you put it like right there right there all right so right here it gives you a couple of selections you can actually have print sharpening I have it in standard um, where you can pick low you can pick high it actually just sharpens the picture a little bit I don't like it too much I like it for mine to be standard and then if it's matte paper and in this case it's semi gloss so I'm just gonna leave it at glossy um, print resolutions I, I leave it at the highest settings that I could get um, so I have it at 425 and that's it you just go to printer and and that's pretty much it um, and that's really my main source of printing now let me also show you that you can actually do collages uh, which is kind of neat um, you can actually save it to PDF and everything but you can actually do collages and let me show you how that could be you can actually let's put it let's put you want to put it like that actually put this one on top put that one and then pick another one let's say this one you can actually go like this and you get it an idea of how to do collage and you can actually do two three four five um, and that's pretty much it and you press print 13 by 19 you got to remember to pick your paper and you press print and that's pretty much it uh, thank you all for watching uh, this is Lovasquez